Oh, now then, my friends, <laughs> how are you doing? Now, here's a thing for you, uh, something to be happy about. Well, I'm in Sheffield. Uh, well, actually, no, that's not anything to be happy. Well, it might be something to be happy about. That's, that's not what I'm talking about is. Um, lighter nights are coming, aren't they? We're out of January. Uh, we're on the other side now. Every day is going to get lighter. February is a short month anyway. Am I going the right way here? Yep, there we go. Sheffield. Um, every night now, getting lighter. Uh, we're on February short, so we can get through that really quickly, 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 quickly. I'm excited. Uh, and then we're into March, uh, and then the daffodils will be out, it'll be spring, uh, the good weather's coming into force. So it's something to be happy about. So there you go. Uh, and I'm in Sheffield, and that's something to be happy about because uh, my brother in law's from here, uh, and he says, um, Sheffield's the capital of the world, he says, apparently. So, um, that's where we're off to, Sheffield. And we are off to Wendy's, my friends, uh, because it's an American diner, isn't it? American burger joint. And uh, I'm off to America soon, and I thought, you know what? I'll break myself in gently and go to Wendy's. And uh, there's a few of them in the UK, one of them being in Sheffield. Um, so I'm looking forward to it. I've been to Wendy's in New York before. Wasn't overly impressed, I have to say, with the one in New York. They've got the Dave Burger or the Dave Single and the Dave Double and the Dave Treble. So we're going to go and try that out. Uh, and it'll be interesting to see what uh, Wendy's is like compared to Wendy's in uh, America. Wendy's in the UK compared to Wendy's in America. So I am kind of looking forward to it. Um, I mean, I had a bit of a sort of like a bit of a bad experience at the Wendy's that I went to in New York. It wasn't the greatest of places. It was a bit of a dirty one that I'd gone to. It wasn't the cleanest. Uh, there was no sit down seats in there either. So I'm hoping there's, I can sit down in here, have a nice meal, sit down, review it and mark it out of 10. If you're new to the channel, by the way, uh, and you like the content, then hit the subscribe button. In fact, if you've got this far and you haven't even watched me yet, then I'm guessing you like the content, otherwise you would have turned off. So hit the subscribe button, click the little bell for notifications of when I upload new videos. Now, without further ado, my friends, let's go. Sheffield, Steel City, home of the Full Monty as well. Who remembers that film, The Full Monty? You can leave your hat on. What a great movie that was, Steel City. Now, by the way, I didn't realize Sheffield is a clean air zone. So if you've got uh, a petrol car or a diesel car, uh, you've got to pay uh, an emission charge. Um, I guess another way of keeping cars out of the city centre and ruining the city centre economy again, isn't it? Councils again. Council rules. Council rules. Um, anyway, Wendy's. Looking forward to this. Um, I've also had a Wendy's at an airport, I think at Newark Airport, um, for breakfast and that was atrocious but you can't really go by the airport ones because they're not really the same say it's like Weatherspoons. Um, I've been to Weatherspoons at Gatwick and I might try that again actually on my way to New York um, and try their breakfast it's overpriced it's not as good it's never the same um, but anyway looking forward to it probably go for the Dave double I think the Dave trebles a bit or should we go for the Dave treble I always say go big or go home um, so we might have to go for the Dave Treble actually and see what it's like. It looks big on the pictures, but a little bit like Falling Down, that movie with Michael Douglas. Turn around, look at that. You see what I mean? It's, it's plump, it's juicy, it's three inches thick. Now, look at this sorry, miserable, squashed thing. It never actually looks like that, doesn't it, on the picture? Then when you get it, it's a squashed, flattened, dried up thing uh, but anyway we'll give, we'll give them the benefit of the doubt come on onwards <laughs> I 
tell you what, Sheffield now, people of Sheffield, blimey, you've got to be careful, haven't you? They've got low emission zone cameras, right? They've also got bike lane cameras, bus lane cameras. It's like a, it, blimey, it's like a computer game trying to avoid the cameras and avoid the fine. Um, Derek Dooley way, who's Derek Dooley? If you know who Derek Dooley is, pop it in the comment section down below. And don't Google it, that's cheating. Now, where are we? 350. There we go, I need to go left. Hang on a minute. Speed cameras as well, gotta be careful. Right, here we do. We'll do here, I think. Park the milk float. There we go. Right, side of the road. We've got a little bit of a walk, <clears throat> but uh, we'll leave the car here. Hopefully the wheels are on when I get back. And they should leave it alone. I mean, it's only a milk float. Right, come on, onwards. God, I tell you what, whew, it might be blue skies, but it's chilly. It's a cut, it's fresh. <laughs> right, let's find this Wendy's in Steel City, Sheffield. Do you know what's weird about Sheffield is? People of Leeds, they don't accept it, do they, as part of Yorkshire. I said to Sarah the other day, I said, um, oh, Sheffield, it's Yorkshire. And they went, she went, yeah, but it's South Yorkshire, isn't it? I said, well, what's the difference? She went, nah. they don't kind of accept it as part of Yorkshire, do they? I think they want to give it to Nottinghamshire. We'll take it. Right, here we go, Wendy's, which is right next to McDonald's. Is it any better than McDonald's? That's the big question. Could Wendy's be the next, get my teeth back in, be the next American invasion? Well, let's find out. Well, it looks a lot nicer than the one that I went to in New York, I have to say. Here, have a look. Right, let's uh, take a closer look at these, but I tell you what, it does look quite a big burger, I've got to say. Oh, losing the fry.
Right, so first impressions on this, it actually looks, um, it's, quite, it's, quite, it's quite a big uh, bit of a beast that, uh, and a lot better presented than the ones that I had uh, in New York. We've got bacon on there, we've got lettuce, got a nice big tomato on there as well. Uh, three patties on there, cheese, I think I put jack cheese on there as well, added some bacon. I've uh, got a brioche bun, nice fresh lettuce as well, and a the sauce on there. So if I can get my mouth around this, I can need my sister here to put my mouth around this one. She's got a big mouth. Here we go. Mmm. Wow. Oh, wow. That is really... Well, it's tasty. a tasty burger. Off the bat, nice tender cooked patties there, square, fresh lettuce, baking is nice. That sauce is beautiful, got some onion on there as well. So far, I reckon that's actually tastier than the one that I had, a lot better than the one I had in New York, which was a bit of a disappointment. Got the uh, sweet chilli sauce. Got a spoon as well for the, um, this is like their shake. What was it called this? I can't remember. Comment down below. Mm. Frosty, that's it. And that, see that's nice. That's how it should be. The frosty that I had in New York was all watery. Mm. Wow, that's actually, that's very nice. Going for a fry. Hey, the fries are good. Saltiness to them, crispy on the outside, fluffy on the end. I've got to tell you though, that burger is excellent. Right, I reckon I'll eat this and then we'll mark, then we'll mark it out of 10. But I'm impressed. Wendy's, and also I'd like to say, the staff here are a lot better a lot more friendlier than the one I went to in New York. I said, oh, I've got no napkins. And she's already downstairs and then she went and fetched them for me. So credit where credit's due. There we go. Wow, that is tasty. That cheese has got a little bit of a, a little bit of a nip to it as well. Mm. I've got to tell you, um, I really enjoyed that. I'm, I was, I was, I'm really surprised because the experience that I had when I went to the one in New York was totally different. That frosty uh, was all melted and didn't taste anything like that at all. Um, the burger, wow. I mean, I don't know, have they changed the recipe for the UK or is it? 
I know they have a smaller menu, but wow, it was absolutely it was really tasty. Um, that cheese, I think I added. I think I added a cheese to it. I went through just adding everything I could. But there's a cheese with a little bit of a little bit of a nip to it, a little bit of a bite. Um, thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed it. The sauce on it was fantastic. The uh, the brioche bun, fresh salad, fresh. The nice big tomato on there as well. Not them tiny little tomatoes that you get on there. Uh, proper is it plum tomato? Is it like a big Big tomato, I love them. Um, like you get in, on the American burgers. Um, it was bursting with flavor. The fries were gorgeous. Just the right amount of crispiness to the outside with, without being too overly done. Uh, the inside were light and fluffy. Um, the, uh, the frosty, I mean, that was great. Uh, I mean, dipping a fry in it, it's, as it said on that picture, did it work? Yeah, it did actually. <laughs> <laughs> Never think of having a fry with a with a with a with a milkshake, basically. Uh, but it did work. The whole thing tasted way better. The experience was way better. Maybe I went to the wrong Wendy's. I went to a Wendy's that you couldn't sit down at in New York. So <clears throat> maybe a Wendy's in New Jersey somewhere or in other parts of the U.S. where you can sit down and you have a little bit of a bit of a better experience might be better. But for me, that was better way better than mcdonald's way more filling i think it was 1369 off the top of my head um with everything in it, it 1369 you'll, you'll have seen on the screen anyway uh, but it was spot on and filling i mean wow was it filling i mean you didn't have to have the triple you can have the single double or the triple the day's triple but i tell you what mcdonald's uk watch out because wendy's is coming for you because I think it's way better than McDonald's. Way more filling in a different league. league. Loved it, absolutely loved it. I'm just watching what the parking wardens are doing with all the traffic, with all the cars over there. They've been around that car behind me for about an hour. They got anything else to do? I don't know what they're doing, it must be nicked. Anyway, uh, that's all from me today. Wendy's UK. Oh, I've got a market, haven't I? Um, I mean, as far as fast food chains go, I'm going to say, I'm going to say 9.1, 9.1, um, as far as fast food chains go, it was spot on, I highly recommend it, I think there's more than one in the UK, uh, I want to know Wendy's, when are you coming to Leeds, when are you coming to Nottingham, bring more out, wipe the floor with McDonald's, because let's be honest, McDonald's have gone downhill recently, haven't they, their prices have increased and the burgers have shrunk. Whereas Wendy's, I mean that was just huge. I mean that was that was big. I mean I mean that I'm gonna say was a tasty burger. Mm hmm. This is a tasty burger. To coin uh, the phrase of um, what's his name? Can't even think now. Samuel L. Jackson. That's it. Anyway, if you liked it, if you liked the video, hit the subscribe button, give us a thumbs up, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.